Have you ever pondered the possibility of traveling through time? This question has captured the human imagination for centuries, sparking countless works of science fiction and fueling the dreams of both casual dreamers and serious scientists. Is time travel merely a fantasy, a construct of imaginative minds, or is there a sliver of scientific possibility nestled within this fantastical concept? Today we're going to delve deep into the enigma of time travel. Throughout this exploration we'll be guided by the lantern of science, illuminating the path as we venture into the realm of the unknown. We will explore four potential methods of time travel, all of which, intriguingly, do not contradict the laws of physics as we currently understand them. These are not mere flights of fancy, but grounded theories rooted in the fertile soil of scientific inquiry. So, buckle up, fellow time travelers. Stick around if you want to unravel the mysteries of time travel. Ever heard of wormholes? They might be your ticket to the past or future. Wormholes are fascinating phenomena that could potentially provide shortcuts through space and time. But what exactly are they? In essence, a wormhole is a theoretical passage or tunnel through the fabric of space-time, predicted by Einstein's theory of general relativity. Imagine folding a piece of paper in half and poking a hole through it. That's a rudimentary way to visualize a wormhole. Einstein's theory suggests that massive objects like stars and planets warp space-time around them. This warping creates a gravitational pull that we experience as weight. Now, if space-time can be warped, it could theoretically be twisted and stretched to create a tunnel connecting different points in space and time. This is the basic concept behind wormholes. So, if wormholes exist, could we use them as time machines? Theoretically, yes. If we could create a wormhole, we could potentially manipulate it to connect different points in time as well as space. You could step into one end of the wormhole and emerge in the past or future. However, here's the kicker. Creating and stabilizing a wormhole is no walk in the park. While general relativity allows for the existence of wormholes, it also predicts that they would be highly unstable and would collapse almost instantly. To keep a wormhole open long enough for anything or anyone to pass through, we would need a form of negative energy or exotic matter, which is currently purely theoretical. Moreover, even if we could create a stable wormhole, there's the question of safety. Traveling through a wormhole might be akin to diving into a black hole with potentially lethal effects. In conclusion, wormholes are a tantalizing prospect for time travel, offering the possibility of jaunts to the past or future. However, they present significant challenges, both theoretical and practical. For now, they remain largely in the realm of science fiction and theoretical physics. So, although wormholes sound like an exciting method for time travel, they remain largely theoretical and unproven. Now let's weave our way through time using cosmic strings. Cosmic strings, in theory, are one-dimensional topological defects in the fabric of space-time. Imagine them as ultra-thin strands of energy, thinner than an atom, yet so dense that a single inch of a cosmic string could weigh as much as Mount Everest. These strings, if they exist, are predicted to have formed in the early universe, stretched across the cosmos like some unfathomable cosmic web. Here's where it gets even more intriguing. Some scientists propose that if two of these cosmic strings were to pass close enough to each other, they could warp space-time in such a way to form a loop. This loop, in theory, could be used as a passage through time. Just like how a wormhole could act as a tunnel through space, this cosmic string loop could potentially be our gateway to different times. But of course it's not as simple as it sounds. For starters, cosmic strings are purely theoretical. Despite decades of searching, we have yet to find definitive proof of their existence. Even if they do exist, they're estimated to be incredibly rare, potentially only a handful in our observable universe. Then there's the challenge of actually using them for time travel. The forces involved would be colossal you'd need a spaceship capable of withstanding the intense gravitational forces generated by the cosmic strings. And then, there's the task of navigating the cosmos to find and align these strings in just the right way to create a time loop. To say it's a monumental task would be an understatement. Yet despite the odds, the idea of using cosmic strings for time travel remains a tantalizing possibility, a testament to the boundless human imagination and our relentless pursuit of understanding the mysteries of the universe. The cosmic strings theory, while fascinating, is still a far-fetched idea for time travel. Black holes, the monstrous maws of the universe may hold the key to time travel. 
These cosmic creatures are regions of space where gravity is so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape their gravitational pull. But it's not just physical matter that gets trapped, time itself bends under the weight of their immense gravity. This is the phenomenon known as time dilation. To understand time dilation, we need to delve into the realm of Einstein's theory of relativity. According to this theory, the stronger the gravitational field, the slower time passes. In the vicinity of a black hole where gravity is extraordinarily intense, Time slows down significantly compared to areas of weaker gravity like Earth. Picture this, if you embarked on a journey near a black hole and managed to avoid being sucked in, you'd experience time at a much slower rate than those back home. You might spend what feels like a few years on your cosmic journey, but when you return to Earth, you'd find that decades or even centuries have passed. In effect, you've traveled into the future, but as enticing as this time travel method sounds, it's not without its risks. Black holes are violent and unpredictable. Their extreme gravitational pull can stretch and distort anything that gets too close, a process rather ominously known as spaghettification. And that's not even mentioning the possible existence of the singularity, a point within the black hole where the laws of physics as we know them cease to apply. Moreover, there's the challenge of surviving the journey both to and from the black hole. We're talking about traveling distances that are virtually inconceivable to us and dealing with the harsh environment of outer space. So while theoretically possible, a journey to a black hole is fraught with danger and uncertainty. It's a thrilling concept, a testament to the limitless potential of the universe and our understanding of it. Yet it serves as a humbling reminder of how much we have yet to learn about the cosmos. Black holes offer a tantalizing but perilous possibility for time travel. Our final method for time travel comes straight from Einstein's theory of special relativity. This theory, proposed by Albert Einstein in the early 20th century, revolutionized our understanding of space and time. It tells us that space and time are intertwined into a four-dimensional space-time fabric. What's truly mind-bending about this theory is that it suggests the rate at which time passes can vary depending on an object's speed and gravitational field. So how does this relate to time travel, you ask? Well, let's dive in. Imagine you're on a spaceship that's capable of traveling at near-light speeds. According to special relativity, the faster you travel, the slower time passes for you relative to someone who is stationary. This effect is called time dilation. In other words, if you were to embark on a space journey at such speeds, time would pass slower for you than it would for people back on Earth. By the time you return, you would have aged less than everyone else, effectively having traveled into the future. Sounds like science fiction, right? But this isn't just theoretical. Time dilation has been tested and confirmed with extremely precise atomic clocks on board GPS satellites and fast-moving aircraft. Now, the challenging part. To achieve time travel through special relativity, we would need to reach speeds close to the speed of light, which is about 676 million miles per hour. That's faster than anything we've ever built. The energy requirements for such a journey are staggering and far beyond our current capabilities. Moreover, there are many hurdles to overcome. The effects of high-speed travel on the human body are still unknown. And then there's the small matter of building a spaceship capable of such speeds. Traveling at light speed may be our most promising method for time travel, but it's still beyond our current technological capabilities. Yet who knows what the future holds? With the rapid advancements in technology, Perhaps one day, we might be able to unlock the secrets of time travel through the root of special relativity. So there you have it, four scientifically plausible ways for time travel. Let's do a quick recap. First, we explored wormholes, twisting the fabric of space-time to create shortcuts. An intriguing concept, but the challenge lies in keeping these tunnels stable. Then, we dived into cosmic strings, narrow strands of energy left from the early universe. They offer the potential of time loops, yet, Harnessing their power is a feat we are yet to achieve. Moving on, we examined black holes and their time dilation effect. The closer we get, the slower time passes. A thrilling idea, but the immense gravity and radiation make it a hazardous journey. Lastly, we considered traveling at light speed, as suggested by special relativity. Intriguing, but we're still figuring out how to reach such velocities without turning into stardust. While time travel remains a captivating concept, it's clear we have many scientific and technological hurdles to overcome. But who knows what the future holds? Perhaps one day we'll master the art of navigating through time.